Hello, um, when you bought the Arduino uh, entry kit from Delightful Tech Toy, most probably you receive the package like this. Um, when you open the box, the box, then uh, you see this um, the Arduino board here and the LCD display, the Lumeco, um keypad, USB cable. Arduino jumper wire and the breadboard here. So uh, when you're going to connect the Arduino board, I would uh, suggest you to install the pro install the program first, according to your operation system platform. Uh, click the appropriate linkage. So you download this uh, zip file to your computer and uh, this zip file contain the folder of here all the necessary program and example uh, driver already stored here uh, try to extract this folder to your to your computer under the program files folder like this this is the program files so I do know it's here so uh, you can see um, there has the examples here uh, main program and the drivers. If this is the first time you connect the Arduino board to your computer, uh, the computer most probably will ask you for the drivers, so try to uh, give the path here FTDI USB drivers. Then um, your USB to serial driver will be installed. Uh, in the meantime, I would suggest you to make a shortcut of uh, this program to your desktop. This is most convenient for you to um, start the program. I'm going to connect the Arduino board here to here. So you can see the power LED already light on. And um, this is the L LED. Um, the label L LED. So uh, this is connected to the pin 13. Why this LED start to blinking? Because the blinking software, um, the program already um, upload to the to the 80 mega uh, microchips here. So the program already start. But we will show you how to use the Arduino environment to compile the program and upload. Yeah, I would like to. Um, um show you uh three main points. Uh first uh you have to choose the correct serial port. Uh how to locate the serial port number you can go to the control panel to see uh what's what is the comfort to connect it with your Arduino board. Um the second point is um this program the default um communication speed is uh, one hundred fifty thousand uh, 200 BP uh, bulb per second. So then um, you have to choose appropriate uh, speed. Otherwise, the connection uh, may be failed. Um, the final point is um, regarding the bot, because uh, this program not only can operate uh, under this uh, 168 80 mega uh, microchips. Uh, this program also can work with uh, free 2 way and Mega Mini BT a lot. So um, make sure you choose the correct one. Um, this is uh, what our uh, board uh, um, provide. So choose this one uh, for the further complying or upload. So now you can see this program. You can uh, open this from the uh, examples and digital and uh, under the digital folder the blank then is this one so um, when you uh, open this file first of all you have to comply this program under this uh, environment so we press this so see yeah, this is already going to comply so see this is already uh, finished the complying already finished so uh, next step, we are going to upload the program.
the program to your to your uh, Arduino board. Uh, we use this button. So now it's going to upload to our board. See um, the board situation now. So you can see um, the LED is still blinking. What we have to check is that we try to put another LED to pin 13 and see what happened. Make sure the polarity, the polarity uh, was according to the seal printing. So you can see these two LED is uh, blinking at the same time. So that's proof the program already uploaded to this uh, IC and now our experiment was finished. Thank you for your attention. Bye bye.